They were brought to me. I don't wish to wonder why this assignment became mine. At the same time, I can't believe that it happened to me because of hospital schedules and professional preparation. There seems to be a lesson here. Yet, I don't know what that lesson could possibly be. Two human female neonates joined together at the chest, sharing one heart. Two baby girls. It is my job, my duty, 
part of my chosen profession. <coughs> Separate these baby girls. Two tiny souls sharing one tiny heart. My job to separate them forever. There is always some risk in the separation of Siamese twins. There is always the risk that one or both might die in the separation. In this case, there is no such risk. One of these human female donates, one of this little girl will die. No risk, no uncertainty, no faith, divine hope. The only risk is the other might leave.
and in this half of the cup. I know I will succeed. The invent separated of Beasley cannot survive without her heart. I'm going to read Treasury Romance Novels and Playgirl Magazine. I'm going to play with myself in my secret hiding place. She must give it up unwillingly to her carbon copy playmate as if it were some toy. I'm going to lose my wallet in a day in the vaccine of a year ago. Not the surviving baby. I see the human 
body encountering and counter countering itself constantly. I'll work as a trap <coughs> and seduce my bosses. And 
what if I am? I love Mexican food. But it won't love me. <coughs> I'll lay each other the first fingers that rushes onto my palm. What if I don't flinch? It's not as 
though you really look at the second class child as a high of access issue. Will you? No, I don't think so. Yeah, neither do I. I admit that this is not a comfortable position to be in.
don't know what to do with her. She is indeed a difficult child. Maybe we shouldn't have told her. How? How could we avoid it? Doctors, media, they all check up on her. She's kind of famous. <coughs> I hate this eyes. And the way she just withdraws. Why does she do that? But she's not trapped inside herself. She's causing trouble for everyone else. Did the school call again? No. Thank them. Just one of the neighbors. It was a terrible. She just wandered into the street and was almost hit by a car. When the car stopped, she started screaming at the driver. As if she was sorry that the car had not run her down. Maybe she was. Don't say things like that. Did you ever wonder? Did you ever wonder what it would have been like when I saved her sister instead? Don't say things like that. Did you? Yes, sometimes. <clears throat> but it doesn't mean I don't love her. Of course it doesn't. That's not what I'm saying. I actually can't imagine it be much different. I just wish that there was something that could do. I tried to understand her. I tried to put myself on her shoes. But I never shared my heart to anyone else. At least not like that. I'm awesome. 
Thank you.